Buenos dias, Rhea Boat here and Bacon. And today we're gonna do our house tour. Before we proceed, I know a lot of you are wondering what made me decide to get this new place. So, the reason behind that is, if you can see from my old condo, super tambak na yung gamit ko from all the PR kits and stocks namin for our business. Feeling ko wala na masyadong space from the old condo. So, I realized that I had to move out para yung mom ko and yung brother ko mas may space na doon. I got a bigger place. For this new place, um, two bedrooms siya and two baths. It's 73 square meters and for now, I'm only renting this place and also the reason why I really got this place because they allow pets, hence Bacon is here with me and he has more space to play around than the on sa old condo namin. Basically that's it and for the rest of the questions that I got from you guys when I was posting the uh, I sneak peek or IG stories for my new place, I'll be answering them later as we go along with the tour. So, yes, let's proceed. Click, click, click this camera. Come on, come on. Click, click. Click. Paw, cover your paw. So, upon entering my house, this is my mini hallway area. Hi, Bakes. So there I have a ceiling to floor mirror here which is good para hindi na ako kailangan bumili pa ng extra mirror for you know checking yourself out before leaving the house yan so for my shura bacon <laughs> so for my shura that I got this from Mandawe Foam yan Mandawe Foam lang yan guys and actually hindi ko talaga siya measure so, yung height and width niya, super perfect for this space. Kasi tinansya ko lang siya. So, whoo, thankfully, swak na swak siya dyan, as you can see. And then, what else? And then, for this lettergram, I actually got this from Lettergram PH. So, I used this for bazaars. And then, the nice thing about this is you can change the texts here. But for now, Bakes, what are you doing? Bakes, what are you doing? And then for this wooden plate, I got this from H&M Home. So for this, this is where we place our keys. Abubot and yeah, mga gamit gamit. So the reason why I decided to place the shoe rack here is para upon entering, it's really important to take off your shoes here before entering the house. Para yung dirt from the outside, hindi ko mala sa loob ng bahay, tama? So, yeah, also. Hi, Bakes. So, let's proceed to the kitchen area. So, this is how my kitchen looks like. Mini lang siya, like me. <laughs> so, when I got this place, kasama na tong cabinets and this one kasama na siya here. Cabinets, microwave kasama na siya and this fridge. So, this all came together with this place. So, semi-furnished na yung condo when I got it, which is good. So, less gastos na lang for me. For the rest of this babies here. I bought this from SM Depth Store. Ito din, itong whole set na to. SM Depth Store lang siya. There. And then for this stainless cup, ginamit ko muna siya for now. Wala pa akong mahanap na gold na stainless na holder na may drain. Kasi ito wala siyang drain eh. Cup talaga siya. I just use this for now. Kasi bagay naman siya. So I bought this from Shopee. Ito rin, Shopee din siya. Lahat na to 
I bought from Shopee. I'll link the shops below so you can check that out later. There. And then for this, I got myself a coffee maker. Actually, mura lang siya. 3,000 ko lang siya nabili sa SM Dep store. So the reason why I got a coffee maker over an espresso machine is with coffee maker kasi you can serve more people in one go than with espresso machine like isa isa mo siyang titimplahin gagawin so it takes more time and effort with this pindutin mo lang yung button na yun then boom you can serve up to 15 cups bonga so basically that's it for the kitchen area hindi mo na ako gagawa ng thorough tour for this area kasi obviously it's still incomplete like it's still 80% Finished. Ah, hindi ko pa talaga na organize yung mga gamit gamit sa cabinets na to. Like this. This is my pantry. Yan. So as you can see, hindi ko siya organized. So I might do a mini renovation for this area in the future. But for now, since everything is working, I'm gonna keep this the way it is for now. So yan. And then now let's proceed to my dining area. I got this table from Mandawe Foam and one thing I like about it is it's super light although this is not a solid wood it's just some um, laminated wood but that will do for now I personally like this because of its wood and steel design it's really perfect for my condo steam which is modern industrial with a mix of bohemian vibe for my water glasses i bought this from nuts and pants and it's from aranaz then for my coasters i just bought this from make room and then for this woven placemat i bought this from h m home basically that's how simple my dining room looks like i'm actually planning to hang my macrame wall decor here but I haven't bought any hooks yet, so it looks pretty plain for now, but I like it. Instead of flipping my dining table towards the wall, I decided to have its orientation this way. So I can separate my kitchen from the living room there. Aside from this being our dining table, Jeff and I, we usually work here as well. So this is Jeff's side and that is my side. And yeah, that's it for my dining room. Let's proceed to what bacon? Let's proceed to the living room. This is my favorite part of the room, the living room. As you can see, I have a lot of plants here just to make it look more homey. So I got this baby from Tierra Plants and same with the butterfly palm. I got that from Tierra Plants as well. Personally, I think plants make your place look more homey. Kaya, I'm planning to get more plants for this space. Then for this part of the room, I have this TV. It's kind of weird that the TV is here, but yeah, I can't do anything about it. Good thing the TV flips, so you can flip it towards the living room or you can flip it towards the dining room. So yeah. So for our sofa bed, this already came with the house. I was actually planning to get a new sofa bed like a leather one, but for now this will do. For my throw, I bought this in IKEA Hong Kong. These two square pillows over here are my old pillows. And then for these two, um, I bought this from H&M Hong Kong and it was on sale so I got them. I like how the patterns and textures give a very tropical vibe look to this space here. And then for my other favorite part of the house, the console table. This is where we keep our cameras and where I keep my favorite books. Also, we have our gaming cards, etc. And I'm actually planning to collect more. So if you have any more suggestions on what games to get, do comment them down below. Then for this basket here, this is where I keep all my chargers, remotes, 
Then for my favorite books over here, these are the books that I've read so far. I'm not really into love stories or novels. I like self-help books, something that would give inspiration or would help me find creativity. So I like those kinds of books. For the second level of the console table, I have my two most favorite books from Paul Arden. Guys, I super, super recommend you reading these books. They are super nice. And here's my camera collection. That's my XD20 that I bought last December. My two-year-old Instax Mini 90. My one-year-old GoPro. <laughs> and then that's Jeff's Instax. And that's Jeff's newest Instax SQ6. And that's Jeff's Instax SQ6. And that's my Minolta film camera. There. Now for the upper level of the console table, this is my air humidifier that's not working. I just bought this for like $799. So I'll be replacing this as soon as I find a good air humidifier. For this Marshall speakers, this was a gift from Jeff on my birthday. And this was also a gift from my boss on my birthday. It's from Turkey. I'm not sure what it is. It looks like an egg, but it's cute. So yes. And then this is my Sennheiser Momentum headphones. Then this butte over here is my macrame wall decker that I bought from Querda Crafts. So this is actually custom made by them for me. I personally wanted a white yarn. Not sure if you call this yarn, but I wanted a white yarn for my macrame wall decker. And I wanted to add beads that would match my condos theme, which is black, gold, and wood. So I think they've done a pretty good job here. It's really nice. I'm actually planning to buy a circle brass mirror here. This macrame wall decker would go in the dining area, as mentioned earlier. Then for this basket, I bought this in Shopee. It actually came with three baskets. Um, this is the large size, the medium size is over there with the fern. And the small one is inside the master's bedroom, so yep. These are all the carpets that I bought from our India trip. And this umbrella is from Ikea, so we have it here. Umbrellas, ukuleles, carpets that we rarely use. It's here. <laughs> then, the nice thing about my living room is I have a small patio or balcony here. So that's my view. I'm not gonna show my neighbors, so that's my view. Um, buildings there, and this is where we hang our clothes when we do our laundry. So nothing really interesting here except that I have a really nice view and I get good lighting during the day here. And we're done with the living room. Now let's proceed to these two rooms here. This is actually a spare bathroom. I got that rug from True Value. So this is just a spare bathroom. There, spare bathroom. There. This is where I keep all the mops since no one's using it for now. Now for this extra room, I'm actually planning to turn it into my mini studio but for now, it's super messy inside. This is where we store all of our stock spare shoes, spare clothes. <laughs> so everything's here. I'm gonna show you very quickly. There, so nothing really interesting about this room. Except for this room and for our friend who wants to come over and shoot, Guys, this is your spot. We're planning to put a backdrop here so you can utilize it. And we're also planning to bring in more lights. So this is the only place that you can shoot. You can't shoot in my master's bedroom or in the living room. This is only the place for you guys. So yes, if you want to do flat lace, feel free to bring your own props and then you can shoot here. So yeah, for the master's bedroom, So this is my room here. This is my 
bathroom so nothing special with my bathroom so it looks bare for now and one thing I also like about my bathroom is that I have this huge mirror here and nice thing about this bathroom is I have my rain shower and my hot and cold pa siya. so yes basically yan lang yung itsura talaga ng bathroom ko looks clean but I like how clean it is so that's it for my bathroom and I have my mini hallway here as well before entering the master's bedroom this is my closet it's super messy for now and I still have to fix my closet so for now no closet tour yet I might do it on my next vlog so we'll see for the master's bedroom so here this is my room it's actually nice having so much light coming into my bedroom except that it gets super hot here during the day like now it's super hot and let's start with this bed a lot of you guys were asking about the bed frame so this already came with the house so hindi na kami bumili na or nagpagawa pa ng bed frame actually pati yung mattress kasama na rin siya dito sa house the only things that we bought were the pillows and the duvet and duvet cover so everything is from ikea and this is jeff's side of the bed and that's my side of the bed over there so for my side of the bed, I have this small box here to hold all of my chargers. Um, I have control of the aircon and TV. Uh, alcohol. <laughs> I decided to hang my jackets here and our towels only because my closet is super full already. So I'm actually planning to do a closet sale soon make sure to follow me on instagram to get notified for my makeup slash work desk as you can see it's super messy i haven't organized things yet i'll be working on this space soon and reorganize everything and probably make a separate tour for you guys but for now this is how my makeup slash work desk looks like so there i got the flat from tiara plants as well and then for this chair, I got this from Mandawe Foam. And then for the furry thing, I bought this in Furniture Resource Philippines as well. And then for my desk, I got this from Below SRP. It was only around 3,000 pesos ata, so super cheap niya lang. And we just assembled it ourselves. Yeah. And for that messy area over there, this is where I keep all of the PR gifts, PR kits, PR things there for now just to remind me that I need to shoot them ASAP and post them on my Instagram <laughs> so it's just there to constantly remind me of my duties and then here um, I have a pen holder and then these are my essentials skincare essentials which I'll be sharing soon so let's skip that part first so and then these are all of my favorite scents for now book that i'm currently reading there and then my bullet journal it's here then for this five unit drawer here i had this custom made from the woodpecker manila and this actually has the same dimensions and design with the ikea alexa five unit drawer anyway this is where i keep all of my makeup products and i haven't organized everything yet as mentioned earlier i'll be doing a separate tour for my work slash beauty desk for this towel over here i bought that in h&m hong kong it was on sale so i got it and then for the basket i also got this from h&m so this is actually where we pile up all of our dirty clothes then for this faux cow skin carpet here I actually bought this from Amazon. This is not the real one, guys. It's just a faux cow skin. It's super nice. I like it better than the real one, though. Then, for this poof thingy over here, I bought this from Nuts and Pants as well. You can check their website out. I'm gonna link this thing down below. Then, a lot of you have been asking me about this huge floor mirror that I have here. I bought this from SM Depths and I got this for 999 pesos only. So, I think we're done with the overall tour. 
And last but not the least, for those who are asking if Jeff and I are living in, technically he's just here for a month since I just want him to stay with me for a month until I adjust fully in this house. Yep, that's it. That's it. I hope I answered all of your questions. And if you still have more questions, feel free to comment down below. So that's it for my house tour. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. And before we end this video, I have a big announcement for you guys. I will be collaborating with Microfly and we're doing a home decor shopping within Metro Manila in collaboration with Ford Movies. And that will be up on my next vlog. So make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye! Go back there, babes. Go there. Make muni muni. Yan, sige, muni muni pa. Okay. Okay, babes. Oh, you're there. Wow, don't be